day two, I can fly. Our focal scripture for today is that popular portion of scripture where the Apostle Paul was speaking to the Philippian church. What he was basically telling them was that he was comfortable in any circumstance. He had the ability to go through any situation. He had the temperament to overcome any challenge. He had the audacity to reach any height. He had the capacity to bear any level of pain or trial. And so can you. The Apostle Paul could do all things because he was strengthened by Christ. If you are going to be able to make this claim yourself, you also need to be strengthened by Christ. First, however, is an acknowledgement that you can do it by yourself. Then, it's a releasing of yourself to his eternal spirit. You and I know that it's not physical strength that Paul was referring to. It's that inner strength, the indomitable spirit that only God can give. My prayer is that as you wait on God in this season, he will strengthen you with might by his spirit in your inner man. Even though your outward man is weak, but your inner man is being strengthened daily as you release yourself to God. Don't give up. Don't give in. Wait on him and you will soar like an eagle. The storms of life will actually make you stronger. This is your season to soar. Wait on the Lord. And again, I say, wait. Prayer. Oh God, you can have all of me. I release myself to you today. I declare that without you, I can do nothing. But with you, I can do all things. This is my season to do all things. I declare that I am strengthened in my inner man. I can go through any challenge, reach any height, and bear any burden because of your power working in me. Amen. This devotion is brought to you by Holy Trinity Lagos, a spirit-filled church where we experience the power of God and the beauty of tradition. For more information, you can visit us on www.holytrinitylagos.org. God bless you.